I will show you how to create a night vision shader using a post-process material. First create your material and give it a name. Then open the material and set the material domain to post-process. First create a scene texture and change the ID to post-process input 0. Use a component mask for the color to mask the alpha value out. The mask value then goes into a desaturation node. Next create a scalar parameter and call it desaturation intensity. After that create a vector parameter node and set the color to a night vision green. Next create another scalar parameter node and call it night vision power. Then multiply the color by the power. Next I create two blend nodes. One blend node for linear light and one blend node for pin light. Put the desaturation output into the node's base inputs and the result of the multiply node into the blend inputs. You can then merge the results using an add node. Then create a lerp node and the A value is set to the result of the add node. After that create a C node and set the ID to post process input 0. You can again remove the color output's alpha value using a component mask, and the result goes into the B value of the lerp node. The last node we need is a scalar parameter node, with the name night vision strength, and the default value of 0.5. The strength goes into the alpha value of the lerp node, and the result of the lerp node goes into the massive color. So that's it with the material, but we still have to create a post-process volume and change some values. For this we search in the Play Sectors window for post-process volume and drag it into the level. With the volume selected we first change its infinite extent to true, so that the post-process effect applies to the whole level. Then we search for post-process materials, extend the array by 1 and add the material instance of our night vision material. Inside of our instance we have to change some values. I set the deset intensity to 1, the strength to 0.3 and the power to 0.5. But the material is still too dark for me. To change that I select the post process volume, search for bloom and set the bloom intensity to 15. Next I search for a vignette and set the vignette intensity to 1, so that it's only bright in the middle of the screen. And that's it. Thanks for watching. If it was helpful, give the video a like and subscribe. Bye!